What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, and reliable NBA 2K20 My Team coins, head on over to NBAsafe.com and use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout. What's up, guys? If you want cheap, fast, and reliable MT, and you want to get those spotlight challenges done, hit up my new sponsor, DVDJ, and use code your boy Bugs for 10% off at checkout. And yeah, man, check them out. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K20 My Team video. And guys, today... We do have some market tips for you guys. So if you guys do not know, the market has rose like crazy. I mean, I mean, I made thousands of MT, thousands. I probably made hundreds of thousands off Mellow alone. I made 20k off Bosch. When I sell him, I'm gonna make over 30,000 MT on Chris Bosch. Um, if you guys do remember when those flashbacks dropped, I told you guys to invest in a ton of those cards. And yeah, before we do get in this video, make sure to drop the like so if you're new. And yeah, that would be good. Appreciate it. We're closing on 6K. And I'm going to run this ad. If you're looking to buy a stacked NBA 2K account with max badges and more, visit SportsTMB.com. He has been in the community for years and has hundreds of reviews. Click the first link in the description to get your account today. And yeah, man, if you don't follow my Twitter, make sure to go do that. Do right now. Chris Bosch was going for 100,000 MT last night. I got him for 62,000 MT. That is about 30K profit. Of course, mine didn't sell. He's at 93K. But once that 93K sells, he's at 97K. I'm going to make about 25,000 MT off Bosch in one day. I'm making, between Bosch and Mellow, over 50K MT. The market is rising like crazy because Mellow, I mean, not Mellow, because Giannis ended up breaking the market. And last night I was 4-0 on Unlimited and I got an error code when I was up 1 with the ball with 20 seconds left. So how to hit up 2K support. They're honestly, they really don't help. They take forever to answer. And honestly, I always try and they never help. But if you guys have had success with them, please let me know down below. But yeah, right now, man, market is really, really high. If you guys remember, Magic was like at 150. Everything's kind of really, really high right now. And also, and also... A lot of crazy stuff's going on with the market, so you guys should definitely take advantage, sell your cards, and get ready. Um, if you would, if you would like, I would recommend selling your cards and then picking up a budget squad for the meantime. Like, if you guys don't have Lance Stevenson, pretty much that, um, pretty much insane like budget opals in my opinion. Like Lance Stevenson, the new John Wall is really good. He actually played really good. Um, the new Michael Ray Richardson, six five point guard with really good defense. There's a lot of good cards in this game. This big Z is really good too. He grabs a lot of boards. But yo, right now, I literally, all I have to say is pretty much sell your cards. Pick up what, uh, I would not buy any cards right now. If you sell your team and your team's worth 100K plus, you're going to dub out. The market's really high. You should probably do what I'm selling you to because since the market is so high, if you don't sell your team and then the market crashes, you're going to lose a lot of MT. And especially if you have no MT to rock with. I would definitely, definitely recommend selling your cards, considering the fact that if you don't, I mean, you're really just taking it out, like straight up. There's really nothing else to do in this game right now. There's no spotlights. There's really just unlimited. If you got James Worley already, there's really nothing to do. If you guys don't remember, I did miss this card right here for 2,000 MT. That was such a big L. Probably one of my biggest Ls ever. I'm trying to get him on the squad. But yeah, man, uh, supposedly... A lot of people have been sniping Giannis, and a lot of Galaxy Opal snipes are going around. So if you guys want, if you have the 100,000 MT, I would recommend sitting on this Opal filter all day. Personally, I don't really snipe. I make all my MT off investments. Like, I took advantage big time off the, what's it called, all the Super Packs. I probably bought around 10 Larry Birds. Not 10. I probably bought around 5 Larry Birds, and I actually made a lot of money off him. I sniped out a couple for 70,000, flipped them for 98,000. So if you do the math, that's a lot of MT made, around 20,000. And I'll run like 15,000 MT, all five of them. I still have one in my collection too. But yeah, um, if you guys don't know, my team is really, really good. I got Zion. Also, dude, if you guys picked up Zion, I'm pretty sure he is bid again. So I always talk about him, his price. Um, he's definitely a bid again, I think. Yeah, dude, he has only... Wow, this card is so freaking rare. Like straight up, he's so damn rare. I He's 100,000K. 100,000 MT with an hour 25 left. If you guys have any of these pink diamond cards like Zion that are rare, please, I would recommend selling. If you want to sell your Chris Webber, he's expensive too. Pretty much all the cards that were were buyout during the market crash on Thursday night is now double, triple. So like, yeah, Chris Webber is no longer a buyout. He was around 80,000 MT if you picked him up. He's going for over 100K and he's this rare. 
those buzzer beater cards are really rare also if you want to sell your opals now is not a bad time um curry curry is really expensive and whoa what 410k i got him for two i got him for 180k so wow um curry might have to hit the auction i do have Giannis and lebron i don't really want to sell him but yeah curry's in the auction that is crazy so if you could <laughs> if you guys have curry i would recommend putting him up on the auction right this second because 400,000 mt even if you get i don't know even if you get what's it called even if you get like freaking 280k you're still gonna make a ton of mt my curry's going up there if he sells for 400k that is a huge w pretty much every card if you guys have that galaxy with tracy mcgrady if you have pink diamond tracy mcgrady i'm thinking about selling everyone on my team besides Giannis. and yeah lebron wow yeah he's getting sold he's at 200 something k wow i'm shocked let's see glitch lebron right now man i've never seen the market this high in a really long time i saw jr smith for 100k buyout of course he sold for 120 lebron selling for three something pretty much one of the only cards that could stop the Giannis. Giannis is so unguardable Giannis is actually dropping in price which is crazy i should have sold him at a mill and then picked him up for 700 but honestly it's whatever uh lebron's going for around 340 again i got him for around 320 pretty much every card is so high every card that's actually usable in this game is really expensive you notice all the glitch point guards are really expensive as well anything in the buzzer beater set if you guys invested in really expensive paul pierce went up weber went up Drazen petrovich went up pretty much the whole set is up a ton i mean a ton so you guys can definitely take advantage but what's his name petrovich was thirty thousand mt not too long ago i was thinking about investing in him but i kind of ran out of mt and yo Drazen petrovich is now wow yo there's like no the auction you remember he was flooded I got over 30,000 MT and he's now 56,000 MT. So, guys, right now is the best time to sell your team. I am putting up my whole team. You will see my team empty. I'm keeping LeBron and Giannis. I'm, yo, I saw KD go for 500,000 something, 500 something thousand MT as well. Let's check that out because I heard he was going for a ton as well. Hold on one sec. Kevin Durant Opal, 386,000 with 38 minutes left. He's probably going to go for 480, 500. So that's also crazy, man. This game is insanity right now. Pretty much every card you do have is going up for the high. Uh, let's check out Perzingis. Right now, man, I would recommend sniping. You guys know the snipe filters. I'm actually going to drop a top five snipe filter video after this. But oh my goodness. I don't know if it's just Sunday, but Magic Stone for 250 wow Kawhi's back up a ton clay thompson's no longer a buyout so like clearly bro Giannis has broke this game like straight up he literally broke this game single-handedly everything is up this much it's kind of getting me like scared like i've never seen this so if i sell my whole team <coughs> that's a huge w selling bird everything is no like once a market crashes again bird zion all these dudes that are close to buyout, Weber, they'll all be buyouts again. So that's why I'm saying sell now. With Tracy McGrady going for around 200 something K again, he was at 130K when they dropped the um, the new Opal McGrady. So time to sell, guys. Time to take advantage of this. Pretty much, if you guys have any players, man, sell. Um, if you want to sell your Opals, sell. They'll go back down in price. I'm about to get all my MT back make more mt buy them when they're really cheap because honestly i don't really need to play this game right now they gotta fix my damn they gotta fix this i'm 3-0 i should be 4-0 and, and they gotta fix this so yeah that's really all i got for the video i mean enough said man sell your team if you have curry go on the auction block right now and sell him because he will be 200,000 mt again let's see what he's at right now steph curry there's no way with 12 minutes left this card's at 410 this one's at 250 with an hour left so yeah, I would definitely recommend putting them up. There's not that many on the auction. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please stay tuned for more content. Hope you guys enjoyed. Have a good one. Peace.